Hello and welcome to the beautiful Lekta city of Hawassa. We are in the week 23 of the 2022-2023 Betting Ethiopia Premier League as your World of Champions brings you a clash between the waves of Tana and a club referred to as Jaganet Kokebe, Ethiopia Bona. The Hawassa University Stadium is the place to be as the second place Bahidar Ketema seek to exert more pressure on the defending champion St. George. And it's a good one. It's through the midfield and it's a good shot, a good shot. And he hits the post. That was a good shot by Antenna Tepera. Looks like there's an infringement on an offside there. The touch was good. I did not see any offside really because Fethuddin Jamal was already in the box when the ball got controlled by uh, Mohamed Nasser. And the ball is played wide. It's a shot. Oh, good stop. Coming in from Fasil Gebri Mikhail. Oh, that was a moment attended to Ferreira alone with the goalkeeper. The, the touch and the pass, the quick decision making. Good spacing of time there by the goalkeeper. Alelin, Pitum, 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 Kasbah, Pitum. What a good save by Ezekiel Morake. First golden opportunity has been lost by Pitum. He should have taken the shot earlier. Look at the pass, the concentration on Pitum. Takes Kwekudua out, does everything correctly. Goalkeeper Moraki on point. But again, the defense going to slip and leaving fits him to control that ball. It was easier to have taken the first shot even before. As they launch the ball forward, it's a header by Mohamed Nur Nasi. Well, that's what I'm talking about. That is the prodigy, formerly with Jima Abadifar, Mohamed Nun Nasir, with his 10th goal of the campaign. Look at the float as it comes into the area. No defender in sight. The poaching instinct of Mohamed Nun Nasir coming to life. The defense going to slip completely. No harassment at all for the striker. And he says, I'm a second under. He has Kweku to beat. Fuad. Fuad is a good one. Oh, and it's a golden opportunity for Duresa Chubija, even as they pick it up to Elvira, and it's a header by Haptamu Tedese. Wow! That was a beautiful cross coming in from Firaul Mengistu, and you would ask where were the defenders, even as Haptamu Tedese comes in and scores his eighth goal of the campaign. No one in sight to defend against Haptamu Tedese. Defenders ball watching Kwekudua, not knowing what hit them. Abtar Mutadeh said the goal poacher that he is. Poor defending, perfect. Yeah. Firaul goes past the first defender, Chala Tishita. Can he bring it in? Yes, he can. And it's Fisum, Chalahun with a golden opportunity. Uh, to the detriment of coach Dikiara Gel Yixu. Just check out how much work Firaul does on the left. They are alone with the keeper. The defender's totally unavailable. He sneaks in cheekily. But again, his touch lets him down. Ward Fereja, as they get the first corner in the second half. Ward and Lenin, Asene! From a corner that was brought in by Ward Fereja, Alelina Zene scored his fourth goal of campaign. Look at where Alelina Zene is coming from, the blind side of Ramkel James. Everybody else marking the front nobody remembers him and we said it before gilbert when it's a situation from a dead ball it is always man to man marking and never space marking Yapsira again looking for tadese tadese oh what a miss in a span of one minute two players in golden opportunities yeah those are correct defense cutting passes azene fuad Ademabas! And goalkeeper Ezekiel Morake comes in just at the nick of time. Bumps to Ademabas. Those were too many passes coming in from the center of defense there. The keeper comes out. Oh, yes. You don't face the keeper one on one when he's in motion. Jared Bai. Jared Bai! What a way to take a penalty. The goalkeeper, Ezekiel Morake, did not even make a move. Yeah, he just stood there like he was waiting for the train. <laughs> <laughs> what a celebration from the guys from uh, Lake Tana. It's by Dara beaten 
Ethiopia Kofi by three goals to one. It's full time.